I'm back. <laughs> Surprise. See me on my Instagram channel or Facebook or LinkedIn or wherever you're seeing me now. Here we are. Um, and yeah, I've had some tea uh, and it's caffeinated. Yeah, it's okay. I, I'm also ha very happy and that's good. So today I'm going to talk about pseudo and distracted listening. They're very similar. So I'm going to just read um, what I've come up with for pseudo listening and then distracted listening. So pseudo listening is this occurs when someone gives the appearance of listening, nodding, making gestures, uh, but their mind is really elsewhere. Maybe they're even scrolling their phone. Um, they're not generally absorbing the information you give them. And distracted listening is very similar. The person may be physically present, but they are totally not in the conversation, preoccupied. They've got their own other thoughts, concerns, etc. So how might this play out in a um, conversation with someone? Pseudo listening, so partner A says, I, or the speaker says, I had a challenging day at work. There's been a lot of pressure to meet deadlines. I feel quite stressed. Pseudo listening, oh, really? That's too bad. I know the work can be tough sometimes and they're scrolling on their phone. <laughs> Not nice, but it happens. I've done it. Um, and then distracted listening, the person might say, you know, I've been thinking about our plans for the weekend. Maybe we can try that new restaurant downtown. And the distracted listener is like, mm, yeah, also scrolling on their phone. Um, yeah, sounds good. Sure. Okay. And uh, there's really no commitment. There's really no connection. There's really no um, presence. And I have a funny story about that, but I'll share it another time. Good luck identifying if you do this kind of listening. Bye.